European Union leaders gathered on June 29 to discuss the aborted mutiny in Russia and debate what role the EU could play in long-term Western commitments to bolster Ukraine's security and financing. The nature of that assistance is also on the table in Brussels as Western countries work on a package of long-term assurances to provide weapons, equipment, ammunition, training and other military aid to Kiev. A draft of the summit conclusions said the EU and its members were ready to contribute to future security commitments to Ukraine. But the text caused concern among militarily non-aligned EU members such as Austria, Ireland, Malta and Cyprus and among staunch supporters of transatlantic cooperation such as the Baltic states, who insist European security is primarily a matter for NATO. The two-day summit is a regular gathering of the EU's 27 national leaders, with a range of topics including migration, economic security and relations with China all on the agenda. But the dominant topic is the war in Ukraine, with leaders also discussing how last weekend's aborted mutiny by the Wagner mercenary group could affect Russia. Thank you.